Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the class. It's nice to see you tonight. How are you? How are you tonight? I'm fine, but uh, the climate is hot. Oh, the weather. The weather, the weather, is, hot. The weather is hot. The weather is hot. Yes, you are right. Uh, is it going to rain tonight? Don't you know the forecast? Is it going to rain? It's possible. Oh, okay, we have a possibility. Yesterday, yesterday on the road I couldn't connect. It was raining hard. I'm sorry. Okay, don't worry. Today the storm passes. Okay, it has already rained in the place you yes. live. Yes. Okay. So don't worry about yesterday, right? But okay. it's nice to see you tonight. You, we, we really missed you in this class. Thank you. And also your classmate, right? There were another classmate that couldn't be here with us tonight. Uh, hello, Noemi. Hello, Julia. Hello, Emily, Ruth, and Brian is there. Hello, teacher. How are you tonight? Hello, teacher. Hello, how are you tonight? Hello, good evening. Hello, it's evening. Oh, you are stressful. Okay, yeah, just be happy, right? Relax. And Noemi, how are you? I'm I'm fine. I'm relaxing. Okay, I'm happy to know In that my you're house. Fine in my house. Ah, okay. Do you work at home? Do you work at home? No. No. Not really. Ah, okay. Not really. Okay. Very good. So yesterday topic was tell me about your family. We learned a lot of vocabulary about family members. Do you remember this vocabulary? Let's start with tonight class with this. Which vocabulary do you remember? So let me see, I'm going to share the white word with you. And tell me which family members do you remember? Let's see, for example, how Father, hey, how do you say this, this family member? Son. Okay, excellent. How do you say this? Sister. Oh, uh, sister in law. Step brother. Okay, step. step. It's the brother, and how do you say this? <laughs> do you remember? <laughs> mother in law. Ah, mother in law. Mother in law. Okay, mother in law. Is that correct? In law. Yeah. Mother in mother in law. No. Ah, no. Okay. No. No. It's mother in law. I in love. love. Okay. Uh, what is it like your mother-in-law? Is she good or is she bad? What is your experience with your mother-in-law? Is it true that they are really bad? Sin comentarios, como se dice? Ya no tengo. No comments, right? <laughs> nothing to say, nothing to say about that. Okay, so let's continue Boca today. Cerrada. Ah, okay. Okay, so sister, what is the meaning of sister? Hermana. Hermana, Hermana. Hermana. okay. Hermana. And Hermana. how do you say this in English? Nephew. Nephew, okay, excellent. How do you say this? What is the meaning of this? Primo. 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 Okay, y prima, how do you say prima in English? Cocina. <laughs> it's the same, right? Cocina. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> okay. okay. It's the same, it's the same. Cocina, cocina. And what is the meaning of this? Sobrina. 
Sobrina. Sobrina, excellent. And let's see this other one. Grandmother. Grandmother. Okay, grandmother. And this other one, what is the meaning of this? Madre. Mama. Mama. Okay, mother. Uh, any other way to say mother and father? Do you know another way to say mother and father? Mom. Mom. Okay, Dad. you can say mom. mom. And father? Mom. Dad. Daddy. Mommy. Dad, daddy, mommy, yes. Let me write this. It's like this one. Okay. Any other vocabulary that you remember? Let me know. Let me know. What's one? Brother. Brother. Grandparents. Okay, brother, grandfather. And how do you say tío? Tío, how do you say tío? Okay, uncle. Very good. How do you say tía? Um. Um. Okay, excellent. I can see that you remember this vocabulary. Thank you so much. Now, let me see. Let's go to the platform and we are going to solve one of these exercises. Let me see, we're going to solve exercise 5.3, I guess it is. So let me show you, it's about San, San's family. Let me hide this, and here we go. It's 5.2. Okay, is this one. Any volunteer to read the instruction in English, please? Who wants? Who wants to read the instruction in English? Who wants to read the instruction in English? Sam's family tree. How are these pe people? <laughs> people. Oh, well, yeah. It's just a spell. Okay, it's people. Okay. Related to him. Write the answer on the space provide. You just need to type the name, not a sentence. Do not include a video. Okay, thank you so much. Then let's go. This is Sans family. We studied this family tree yesterday. So we have here the family member, cousin, father, grandmother, niece, sister-in-law, uncle, and wife. And we complete this yesterday, but now we are going to complete the exercise here in the platform. So first question, Andy is Sam's grandfather and Marta is his? Grandmother. grandmother. Ah, okay, is his grandmother. How do you spell grandmother? How do you spell grandmother? Okay, G R. G R A N D A M O T H E R. Okay, that was perfect. Thank you so much. Let's go with the next question. Chris is sand. Chris is sand. Father. Okay, Chris' father is sand's father. Chris is sand's father. Okay, now how do you spell father? Any volunteer to spell father? The F A T H E R. Excellent. Thank you so much. Let's go to the next. Manuel is Sam's. Manuel is Sam's. Uncle. Uncle. Okay. Uncle. How do you spell uncle? Can you spell that for me? Uncle. U N C L E. Thank you so much, uncle. Let's go to the next. Sam is married to Yumiko. She is his wife. Wife. Wife is the right word. Thank you. Let's write in. How do you spell wife? Any volunteer? W A F E. Okay. W I F I F E. E. Okay, excellent. 
And next question, Sam has a brother. He is married to Lisa. Lisa is Sam's sister-in-law. Okay, sister-in-law. 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 Teresa is the daughter of Manuel. Teresa is the daughter of Manuel. She is Sam's cousin. 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 Excellent. Number seven. Jean and Lisa have two babies, Kelly and Jimmy. Kelly is Sam's and Jimmy is his nephew. Yes. Kelly's his niece. son niece. 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 Okay, let's see if you're right. Let's click on send. Okay, 33 point of 33 point. So you got a 10. That was excellent. Thank you so much. Do you have any question about this? No questions? No question. No question. Ah, okay. Okay. Tia Abuela. Tia Abuela. ¿Cómo sería? Tía Abuela. Yo soy Tía Abuela. La hija de mi sobrina es... Yo soy la Tía Abuela de la hija de mi sobrina. ¿Existe eso? Okay. Uh, I'm not so sure. I'm not so sure, but in this case, it could be grand aunt, probably. En grand aunt. Salía la tía abuela, la candy. Ah, okay. Tía abuela. Tía abuela decía la candy. This is the first time I hear this term. So, can we say tía abuela in English? I don't think so. That, that, that's, it doesn't exist in English. But let me investigate and I'm going to tell you later, right? Tia Abuela in English. Tia Abuela. Oh, Grey Aunt. And here it is. According to Google, it's Grey Aunt. Right? Great Aunt. Tia Abuela. Grey Aunt. But let me investigate if this is true, right? I'm going to give you the answer later. Very good question. Thank you so much. Any other question about the platform? No more question. Then let's take a look at this picture. So let's suppose that this is my family. So I'm going to tell you about my family. My family live in San Pedro, Peru, La Pan, Cuscatlán. But I live in Cojutepeque, Cuscatlán. He is my father. He is Carlos. He is 40 years old. He is Kevin. He is my brother. He is 12 years old. She is my mother. She is Maria. She is 41 years old. She is my little sister. She is Elena. She is nine years old. My family love cooking. They enjoy having breakfast together. So this is my family. And in this way, you have to tell your classmate about your family. So you can say, he, he is my father, he's my brother, she's my mother. Uh, also, you can add the name, the age, the place where you live, which other information is important about your family? In yesterday's example, we saw that also we can give some physical appearance description. You can mention some physical appearance and also the way they are. Right? Uh, they are funny, they are angry, they are sad. I don't know. So you can use adjective. So we are going to practice this. Let me stop sharing. You are going to share the information about your family with your classmate in, in the breakout rooms. 
Okay, how many, how many do you need in the groups? Tell me, would you like to work in pairs or in trios? Mm. Three people, four people? Tell me. Three people. Two. Three Two. people, Three. it's okay. Yeah. Okay, we are 21, so we are going to create seven groups. Bueno, uno va a quedar de dos, ¿verdad? Uh, uh. Okay. So, tell your classmate about your family. Are you ready? Is it clear what you are yes. going to do? Is it yes. clear? Is the activity clear? Yes, it is. Yes. Or no, it isn't. Yes, it is. Yes, yes it is. Okay, yes, perfect. Is. Then let's go to the breakout room. You are going to have five minutes. Five minutes to complete this exercise. Is it okay? Okay. 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 Then turn okay. with your classmate. Here we go. His name is Jesus. He has 42 years old. And my sister, her name is Emily. She has 16 years old. And me, my name is Andrea. And I have 14 years old. And I have a dog. Okay. ¿Cómo se llama la mascota? And her name is Millie. Uh, sería it, uh, it, uh. yes, uh -huh. Uh -huh, sí. <ríe> ok, good job, eh, quiero ver quién más, Emerita, good evening, good evening, I'm sorry, we are three parts of my family, my host, husband is to, he has 28 years old, he had brown hair, brown eyes. He worked in a carpenter and his name is Jose. And I have a daughter. She has seven years. She has brown hair and brown eyes. We have four dogs. Their names are Rock Rex, Taiwan, and some. And we have one cat. The name is Lola. Okay. Okay. Ever, ever. Good evening. Hello. Teacher. Good evening. Tell me. <laughs> Hello, Ronald. And, Hi. And what about Ronald? Tell me about your family, Ronald. Okay. My family is small. Este, in my family. There are, are four people. My wife, her name is Veronica. 
in my two song uh, his name is christopher and andres andres is the uh, house one years old and christopher has six years old okay. Okay. i have four dogs its name is are este, Kiara, Bruno, Tessa, and Hachi. <laughs> okay. okay. Okay, thank you, Ronald. Okay, just You're some, just an expression, right? I heard that you say, I am 19 years old. He, he have, so remember this, the expression to say uh, the years or, or age is I am. So you say, I am 19 years old. Uh, he is, he is nine years old. He is 10 years old. And also when you say, Ronald, you said that you have two sons, two children. Yes. 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 Okay. Then you say their names, their name are. Their ah, okay. Name, their name are. And also okay. when, you, when you say, I have four dogs. So you say yes. they, their names because it's plural, right? Si fuera, ah, okay. solo, si fuera solo un dog, entonces sería it. Okay, it, okay. Yes. okay. But Thank in this you. case, it's their names are, but very good job. That was excellent. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. So do you have any other question? Let's continue practice. Remember the question, what do you do? What does your father do? What does your wife do? ¿A qué se dedica tu esposa? What does your husband do? ¿A qué se dedica tu esposo? Oh, what does your son do? Let's continue practicing those questions. ¿A qué se dedican los miembros de su familia? And also, where do they live? Where do they live? ¿Dónde viven? Continue sharing with your classmate. Thank you so much. Okay. In, in planes de renderos. My okay. mother's name is Miriam. Okay. Uh, my, she's, she has brown hair, black eyes, and my father's name is Jose. Okay. He is tall and, and very como delgado, skinny, skinny. 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 My my young sister is teacher. She okay. works in she works um, in the school. Okay. And my grand sister. Grand sister. Older. Older sister is a doctor. She works in a hospital. Okay. Um, we have a three cats. Three cats. Three cats. <laughs> and we live exactly in Planes de Renderos. Okay. Finish teacher. Somebody is missing. Okay, that was excellent. That's very good. Now they were skinny. You use that adjective, right? So you, it's better to say think. Because it's skinny, it means that it's muy flaquito, right? 
just piel y huesos. Ah. That is skinny, extremely thin, extremadamente delgado. So we use thin. You know, so you say my thin. young, thin. my, yes, thin. T-H-I-N, thin. It's much better in, okay. instead of skinny. And you say my young, my okay. young sister. So you use my younger. Para la, mi hermana my más joven. Sister. My younger sister. Younger sister. Okay, the rest, that was excellent. Younger sister. So see you in some seconds with the rest of your classmate. You did a very good job. Thank you so much, Luis, Erika, and Wendy. See you in a minute. Thank you, teacher. Thank you. Hello, hello, welcome again to the class. How was your practice? Did you tell a lot of things about your family to your classmates? Did you finish? Did you finish the practice? Todos terminaron? O alguien se quedó a medias? Sophie se quedó a medias. Sophie. Ya no nos contó todo. Oh, I'm so sorry for that. <laughs> okay, there are two people missing. Now one person. One is still missing. Okay, now we are complete. So welcome again. So I hope that you have enjoyed this practice telling about your family to your classmates. You say, my father is a doctor. He is 40 years old. He works in a hospital. I have a, a dog. I have a fish. I have a turtle as a pet. And my turtle name is. So, ¿qué mascotas tienen? Just dog and cat? Dog. Oh. Okay. 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 Ah, okay. Okay, very good. Rabbit. Rabbit. Okay, rabbits. Rabbits are very cute. And a very quiet animal. Okay, so let's go with a nice topic, right? Today we're going to start the second topic of this section and it is about the present progressive. Do you know what is the present progressive tense? ¿Ya han escuchado acerca del presente progresivo? ING. Okay, we need the ING form of the verb. Uh, the present progressive is a tense that we use um, when uh, the, the action the action are happening. Uh, what is happening right now? Let's see, for example, in this moment, what is Oscar doing? What do you think Oscar is doing right now? Reading. 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 He's writing. Okay, he is writing. writing. He is reading. Learning. He watching. is watching. Watch. Ah, watching. He's I'm watching. Speaking. Okay, I'm speaking. Yo estoy hablando. I am listening. En este momento estoy yes. escuchando. I am studying English. I am paying attention. I am watching a movie, right? Tengo el tele enfrente, estoy viendo la película. I'm watching a movie. Or oh, I am listening to music too. I am listening to music. Tal vez alguien, ¿verdad? Está con los audífonos escuchando música. Sí, I write the text. Eh, can you please repeat, Daisy? Write the text. Ah, okay. I am writing. I am writing. 
So let's start with tonight's topic and let me show you what are you doing? That is the topic for tonight. What are you doing? So look at this question. What is the meaning of this question? What are you doing? So welcome to your class number 13. What are you doing? This is the topic for today. What is the meaning of this question? What are you doing? ¿Qué estás, ¿Qué estás haciendo? haciendo? Okay, ¿qué estás haciendo? Right now, right in this moment. What are you doing? Now let's go with this. This is the objective for tonight. At the end of this class, uh, this lesson, participants will be able to ask and answer question using the present continuous sí. or present progressive is the same. Present continuous or present progressive. Let's go with this. Uh, look at this question. Are you living at home now? Are you living at home now? So what is the meaning of this question? Are you living at home now? Vives en casa ahora. Ok, es como estás viviendo en tu hogar ahora o te has mm -hmm. mudado. Are you living at home now? Mm -hmm. So you say, yes, I am. No, yes, I'm no, not. not. No, I not. Is your sister working for the government? Is your sister working for the government? So this is third person, right? So we need the verb be to make these things and also the ing form of the verb, the gerund. Is your sister working for the government? You say, yes, she is. No, she's not, or no, she isn't. Are Ed and Jill going to college this year? Yes, they are. No, they're not. But no, they aren't. And then we have information question two. Where are you working now? I'm not working. I need a job. So what is your brother doing this day? He's traveling in the Amazon. Who are your parents visiting this week? They are visiting my grandmother. So yes, no question, and also information questions. So where are you working now? Look at this question. Where are you working now? And also, what are you doing now? What are you doing now? In este momento, ¿qué está haciendo usted? What are you doing? I, I, I am in class. Okay. I'm yeah, watching. I am, I am studying. I am paying attention. I am studying. I am singing. I am listening. I am listening. I am, I am learning sitting. English. I am, I am sitting English. in front of computer. I am sitting in front of my computer. Very good. So I am watching my computer screen. I am writing. I am taking notes. I am taking note. Now let's see the structure for this time. So simple present versus present continuous. With, um, a veces nos confundimos de tiempo. ¿verdad? Cuando utilizar presente simple, cuando utilizar presente continuo. Just remember this. The simple present is this structure. Subject plus verb. Y generalmente se utiliza para scheduled. Horarios and also daily activities. Actividades cotidianas, ¿verdad? Para eso utilizamos el presente simple. Now the present continuum is what is happening right now. Lo que está sucediendo en este momento. O en el momento en que estamos hablando. She is working. So look at the example. She works. Ella trabaja, ¿verdad? Lo hace todos los días. Es algo cotidiano. Look at the other example. She is working. So, en este momento, ella está trabajando. And we need the subject, the verb be, and the verb plus ing form. So, look at the following. Here is the structure for yes, no questions. Para una yes, no question, we are going to need the verb be, subject, the verb in ing form plus complement plus the question mark. So let's take a look at some example here. 
Are you studying? Is he playing soccer? Is he watching a movie? Are they listening to music? Are we paying attention? So look at this example, the first one. We are going to see the answer in this moment. Are you studying? So you have two possible answers. Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Is he playing soccer? So you say, yes, he is. No, he isn't. Is he watching a movie? Yes, she is. No, she isn't. Are they listening to music? Yes, they are. No, they aren't. Are we paying attention? Yes, we are. Or oh, no, we aren't. So we are going to use the verb to be to answer these present continuous tense questions. We are going to use the verb be. So any volunteer to read these questions who wants to practice? Me, teacher Noemi. Okay, thank you. Margarita and Noemi. Uh, Noemi, can you please read the question and Margarita the answer? Okay. okay. Are you studying? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. He is, he, is he playing Sosa? Yes, he is. No, he isn't. Is she watching a movie? Yes, she is. No, she isn't. Are they listening to music? Yes, they are. No, they aren't. Are we paying attention? Yes, we are. No, we aren't. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you so much. That was excellent. So don't forget about the structure. Thank you, Naomi. Thank you, Margarita. So B, subject, verb, in I, 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 N, G, form. Complement in the question mark. Complement plus mark. In the question mark. Now let's see. A structure for WH question or information question. So we are going to need the WH word at the beginning of the question, then the verb be subject, ing form, verb, complement, and the question mark. Let's take a look of the following example. What, what are you doing? What is she doing? What is he doing? What are they doing? And what are we doing? So what are you doing? Let's show you some, some answer as an example. So what are you doing? I am reading a book. What is she doing? She is writing, She's writing a, a report. report. And what is Four. he doing? He is playing He's video playing games. Video games. <laughs> what are they doing? They are speaking. What are we doing? We are sitting. So here information, right? Information question or WH question. Any volunteer? I need to volunteer to practice in these parts. Who wants to participate? Okay, teacher. Luis, thank Luis. you, Luis. And any other volunteer? Daisy. Okay, thank you, Daisy, Carolina. So, Daisy, can you please read the question and Luis the answer? What are you doing? I am reading a book. What is she doing? She is writing a report. What is he doing? He is playing video game. What are they doing? They are speaking. What are we doing? We are sitting. Thank you so much. That was perfect. Perfect, Gil. Thank you, Luis. Thank you, Daisy. Emerita, do you have a question or do you want to participate? Okay, Emerita, I need another volunteer to practice with Emerita. Any volunteer? Oscar, teacher, me. Okay, Emerita and Oscar. Emerita, can you please read the question and Oscar the answer? What are you doing? I am reading a book. 
What is she doing? She is reading a report. What is he doing? He is playing video games. What are they doing? They are speaking. What are we doing? We are sitting. Okay, I really appreciate your participation. That was a very good job. Thank you so much, Oscar and Emerita. Thank you. Let's go with the next. Okay, look at this picture. So I'm going to ask question and you're going to give me the answer. Look at picture number one. Is he drinking coffee? Yes. 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 Okay. Yes, he is. Is he smiling? Yes. 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 Yes.
No, me Marie. Too. Okay, thank you, Margarita. Okay, Julia, can you ask three questions about this picture to Margarita? And she is going to answer a yes, no question, please. Okay. Okay. Uh, Which picture? Um, like it. <laughs> okay, what about this one? Uh, is she repaired the, uh, I don't know, the motor, motor? Engine, is she repairing an engine? Yes, she is. Yes, she is, okay, excellent. Let's go, what about this one? This is the one. Is he? Mm. Cleaning the uh, automobile, como se? Ar. Ar, automobile. Okay. Or car. Automobile or car. Okay. Uh -huh. is yes, he is. The car? Yes, he is. And the last one is this one. Mm. Are they? Watching a series, series, series. Mm, the mm, I don't know. Um, yes, they are. Okay, yes, they are. So thank you so much. Let's go with the next one. Now we're going to practice using WH word. So look at this. What are they doing? What are they doing? What are they doing? They are they are reading reading newspaper. Reading newspaper. Okay, that is a good option. They are reading the they newspaper. They are solving puzzle. Okay, thank you. They are solving a puzzle. Very good. Also, any other option? Are drinking coffee. They are drinking coffee, probably. Let's go to the next picture. What are they doing? They are playing volleyball. They are volleyball. playing volleyball. They are playing volleyball. Thank you. Let's go to the next. What is she doing? She's cooking. She's cooking. Cooking. cooking the dinner. She's cooking the dinner. The next one. What are they doing? They are dancing. They are dancing. They are dancing. They are dancing. Tango. And the next one. What is he doing? He's reading. He's reading. A book. A, book. a book. A book. He is reading, reading a, book. a book. Okay. Excellent. I need to volunteer to practice in this picture. Any volunteer? Me, teacher. Thank you, Emily N. Emily N. Any other volunteer tonight? Who okay, wants to help me? Thank you, Luis. So, Luis, can you please ask the question and Emily is going to answer? Okay. So let's start in this one. What are they doing? They are dancing. What are they playing? They are playing Volleyball. Okay. What is she doing? She is cooking. What he doing? He is reading. 
What, what are they doing? They are playing or playing puzzle, I think. Sol solving. Oh, solving. Solving puzzles. Solving puzzles. Okay. Thank you so much, Luis and Emily. Okay. You did a great job. Thank you. Now, let's go with this question. What are they dancing? What are they dancing? They are dancing. They are, they are dancing, dancing tango. Okay, they are tango. dancing tango. Any they other are... option? Bachata. Ah, okay, they are dancing bachata. They are dancing salsa. Okay, they are dancing salsa. Okay, now let's go to the next question. They are dancing disco. They are dancing disco music. Yeah. Now let's see, what is she cooking? What is she cooking? She is cooking chicken. A soup. A soup. A soup. Yeah. She's cooking a soup. Of chicken. Okay. It's chicken chocolate para choco banano. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so uh, I guess it's <laughs> melting. She's melting chocolate. I'm melting chocolate. It's like derretir, ¿verdad? Okay. Derretir chocolate. Yes, okay. melt. Melt is the verb. So melting. She's mm -hmm. melting chocolate or choco bananos. Uh, she is cooking vegetables. Uh, now, what book is he reading? What book is he reading? He reading um, the Bible, the Holy oh, Bible, the Holy Bible. Bible. Okay. Is reading the Holy Bible. Okay, let's go with the next. Okay, thank you so much for your participation in this exercise. Let's go with the next. We have here some yes, no question. So look at this. If, if it is blue, the answer is negative. If it is uh, like red, the answer is affirmative. Mm -hmm. So is she speaking Korean? What is a good answer? They are yes, no question. What is the right answer here? Is not Okay, the first one is. Which one did you say? Yes, she is. Is she speaking Korean? Okay, remember, blue is negative answer. Red is a problematic no, she isn't. Okay, it's no, no, she, she isn't. She isn't. No, she isn't. Oh, no, she is. She's not. not. La she's otra opción, la que está mencionando el compañero es esta. No, she is not. No, she's not. Puede utilizar no, ambas. Not. Puede utilizar ambas. No, she isn't. Or no, she's not. Let's go to the next one. Are you studying English? Affirmative answer. Yes, yes, I, I, am. Yes. I am. Yes, I yes, am. I am. Yes, I am. Let's go to the next. Is he watching a movie? No. No, he no. is. He is. No, he is. Okay. No, he is. In. What's the or other no, option? Or no, he's not. No, he is no, no, not. He's not. Okay, that's excellent. No, he is not real. He is not. No, he isn't. No, he's not. Are we sitting? What's yes. the answer? Yes. Yes. Yes, yes we, are. We, are. we are. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Yes, yes, we are. Uh, are they eating? Yes, yes they, they are. are. Yes. yes, they are. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. And the last one, are you eating a snack? Are you eating a snack? No, I'm not. 
No, I am not. No. No, I am not. Just do it. Okay, then say no. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. Okay, do you have any question in this exercise? No question, then I need to volunteer who wants to practice. Let me know if you want to practice, please. Me, teacher. Thank you. Me, teacher, and Alejandra. Daisy and Alejandra. Okay, Alejandra, can you please read the answer and Daisy the question, please? Okay. Is she speaking Korean? No, she's no, she's not. Are you studying English? Yes, I am. Is he watching a movie? No, he isn't. No, he's not. Are we sitting? Yes, we are. Are they eating? Yes, they are. Are you eating a snack? No, I'm not. Thank you so much, Daisy Alejandra. That was a super job. Thank you so much. Any other two volunteers to practice in this? Yes, no question. Who wants to practice? Hi. Me, teacher. Oscar and Steve? Yes. <laughs> yes, yes, okay. Okay, Steve, can you please read the question and Oscar the answer? Okay. okay. Is she speaking Korean? No, she isn't. <laughs> are, you, no, she's not. <laughs> are you studying English? Yes, I am. Is she watching a movie? No, he isn't. No, are he's we, not. Are we sighting? Yes, we are. Are they eating? Yes, they are. Are you eating a snack? No, I'm not. Okay, thank you. That was perfect. Thank you so much. Thank you. Are we sitting? Are we sitting? Yes, we are. Are we sitting? Thank you. Very good job, Oscar and Steve. Let's go with the last exercise for tonight. And it's this one. Um, I'm sorry, it's not the one I was talking for. This is from the last class. Okay, now let's practice and tell me, what are you doing now? What are you doing? Let's finish and tell me, what are you doing in this moment? What are you doing? I am, I am studying English. Okay, very good. In English. <laughs> I am studying English. Uh, who is at home with you? What is your mother doing, for example? What is she doing right now? What is your mother doing? She is praying. What is your She's mother sleep. doing? She's sleeping. She's sleeping. She is watching TV. Okay, she is watching TV. Any other answer? What is your mother doing right now? She's praying. She is playing. Playing what? She is playing. Or praying. Oh, praying. Praying. Oh, praying. It's, it's like She's this praying. One. You said with E or, or A? Like this one? A. Praying. Praying. Yeah. Praying. Okay, pray, pray. Pray, team. How do you say entrando la ropa? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, she is. Um, how do you say? It's raining this? right now. <laughs> Des descolgando. How do you say that? <laughs> oh, we can say uh, entering or taking the clothes in. Let me look for this. Oh, sorry, it doesn't exist. This cool guy. 
Okay, here it is. So get down or take down and hand. Okay, let's let's write it in this. She is um hanging. She is unhanging the clothes. It's not descolgando la ropa. No? Oh. She is speaking. She, she is, is speaking. she is speaking in okay. the of the sky. She's she ah, okay. She's praying. She's praying. Yes. She's praying or carrying the sky. Is there? Okay, she is speaking with cat. Okay. Any other? She is speaking by the phone. Okay. She is speaking by the phone. Speaking by the phone. On the phone. Teacher. On the phone. On the phone. Yes. On the phone. She is walking the dog. Oh, okay. Paseando. Uh -huh. She is walking the dog. She's walking the dog right now. Is any dangerous in your neighborhood? She's walking the dog. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, now let's see. What is your husband doing? What is your husband doing right now? I don't have a husband. Okay, <laughs> okay. Nobody's married in this group. I sleep in my children's. Okay, he is taking care of our children. My husband is repairing the the water. Repairing. Okay, he is repairing or fixing water the... in the street. Okay. El volado del agua de la calle. <laughs> okay. So <laughs> let's see. The, the pipe, the pipe or the, the pipe. tubing. Tubing. So, la cañería, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Yes. yes. Okay. Anyone, anyone? What is your husband doing? If not, let's go with the boys in this group. What is your wife doing? What is your wife doing? What is she doing? What is your wife doing? You say she is. Everybody is single in this group. That's nice. She is cooking the dinner. Okay, she's cooking. She's cooking the dinner. Very good answer. Any other? She is in the hammock. Okay, she is resting in resting. the hammock. Any other? Any other answer? She is, she is going to sleep. Okay, she's going to sleep. Any other answer? The last one, the last answer. She is watching the novel. She is watching a uh, soap opera. Yes, soap opera. She's watching a soap opera. Okay, do you have any question about this? Do you have any question no about question. how to ask questions using the present progressive or present continuous? And also how to write sentences? Just remember that we need, um, we have just no question, right? Just no question, then we need the verb be at the beginning, then we need a subject and the verb in ing form. And for the WH question, we need first the WH work, the verb be, the subject, 
and the ver and i in the form and also the equation mark. So if you don't have any other equation, that is the class for today. No questions about the simple. No question. Okay, about the present continuous. That was the topic for tonight. No questions. Okay, then thank you so much. No um, thank you for your attention. Thank you for your participation again. You are doing a great job. I really appreciate when you say, I want to participate. <clears throat> Me, and you say your name. So thank you very much. And please don't forget about the platform, the platform exercises. We need to finish those exercises. If you haven't finished yet, I hardly recommend to you to go to the platform and finish. Finish those exercises, please. Uh, remember that we need to finish then during this week and the other week we are going to take the final exam if you have already okay. done it that's excellent si ya lo hizo, congratulations right? you are okay. just waiting to finish the virtual session uh, to get your diploma very good job for the ones who have already done this Okay, see you okay. tomorrow. Bye bye. See you tomorrow. Good night. 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 Bye bye. Good night. 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 Good night.